Hello there and welcome. In this episode I'm discussing algae scrubbers. These are devices that you use on a marine aquarium and they're generally situated in the sump. The idea of them is very similar to refugium. You create an area where algae can grow and this in turn will remove nutrients such as nitrates and phosphates from your aquarium water, keeping your aquarium a lot healthier. The basic design for an algae scrubber is a small pump attached to a spray bar or waterfall. Below that is a piece of material which is either corrugated or has a high surface area for algae to attach to. On one side or both sides there is a light which shines upon the material and that will promote the growth of algae. So it's a pretty simple design and um, you can make one at home very much like the one featured in this video or you can buy them. Any kind of lighting can be used for growing algae so long as it is at the right wavelength for plant growth. So what is an algae scrubber for? Well just like a refugium it is an area where you can grow algae which will remove excess nutrients from your aquarium as it grows such as nitrates and phosphates which can be hard to keep at low levels in a marine aquarium. Also if the algae is growing well within your refugium or sump area then it generally will be less likely to be growing in your main aquarium thus keeping your aquarium looking cleaner. The idea is when the algae gets to a critical mass you scrape it all off thus removing excess nutrients from your aquarium. Obviously while the algae is growing it is also using up nutrients. The algae scrubber will need to mature for a couple of weeks before you get any significant algae growth but after this period the algae should grow within a week or two. Another benefit to an algae scrubber is that it promotes a safe haven for copepods to grow as copepods love living in predator free areas surrounded by algae. So if you have creatures like mandarins or pipefish in your aquarium an algae scrubber is a great addition to your system to provide a food source for your fish. You can also use this area underneath your aquarium to grow some good types of algae such as dragon's breath, calerpa or any other kind of macro that you wish to cultivate. So I hope it's been helpful, thank you for watching and happy fish keeping!